here come to the second point of the bridge. Anyone can tell me what is the correct position of the bridge? Where should we put the bridge? Hmm? Huh? The mark. Show me, show me, show me. There. Yeah, yes. Uh, the bridge should be between the, the, the mark or in front or back? Mm -hmm. Not sure. You're not sure, okay. So, where should the bridge placed? Mm. And uh, she said the mark, yes, we have a mark here, okay? In the FO, we have a mark. But the bridge should be in between the mark or should be in front or back? Which? I don't think it's in front because uh, too little space. Okay, you think the bridge should be here or a bit towards the mm -hmm. back? A little bit back? So, so you mean you mean the bridge should after between the, here and between the, between between the mark? Between the, the mark. Okay, so you think this bridge is correct? It's in between, okay? Yeah, so you think it's correct, okay? Very nice. And uh, you, tell me, where should be the bridge placed? Uh, I'm guessing from the mark should be front. Your guess? Yeah. The mark from here? Yeah. Here? Yeah. So this is more like in front, huh? Yeah. You think this is correct? Yeah, I think so. Okay, I think this is correct. So you have a different idea than him, okay? So what do you think? I think uh, between, between the marker. Between. Yeah. So it should be <laughs> in the middle. Yes, but mine is too front. <laughs> okay, but yeah. the correct should be in the middle. This is what you, you, mm. you think, okay? Yeah. Mm. Great. And what do you think? Where, where, where is the bridge? Where is the bridge? The bridge should be... Is it correct? It's a bit a bit backwards. More than a, a little bit backwards. So you, you mean you mean? Yeah. So you mean the bridge is the how to go back? Almost here. Uh, oh, okay. So you also think this should pull into the uh. middle of the bridge? Okay, understand. What do you say? You say? What do you think? You put it in. You is not Taiwan person? Oh, not Malaysian. Malaysian. You speak Taiwan. A bit like Taiwan. Okay. I think there's no right and wrong. Just which, whichever sound that you prefer. There's you. nothing wrong or correct. So you do whatever you want. That's <laughs> the free world. Very good. Okay, very good. Okay. I think uh, mm -hmm. if measure from here is in front. Mm -hmm. The first mark. Ah, you think yes. from outside the cut, mm. should be like this. So how about this side? Already. You don't care. You care this side mm. towards this mark. Yes. Oh, that's interesting. Very good, very good. Everybody's good. Everybody's a genius. <laughs> Why I say everybody's a genius, everybody's so good, is that uh, there isn't really a absolute rule. We only have a habit. The habit, if you don't want to use your brains, you don't want to use your head, you think, oh, I just do, everybody does, it is correct to pull it in the middle, okay, like this violin. It is normally correct if you see this is in the middle of the bridge and also, as this lady mentioned, if you put the cut, outside cut here, this is a very, very nice way to measure the bridge. Okay, but that is only a principle, only an idea. 
the absolute correct is this gentleman. He said, I don't care, I can follow whenever I want, but based on what? You must have an idea. You cannot put it anywhere you like because you have to find the sound you like. You say, I want this sound. That's why I want to put it here. You give me a reason. Okay? You cannot say, I have no reason. I just put it there. Then that's an amateur. Okay, that's someone you don't know anything. That everyone have to use a pencil now. Have to use a pencil. Because you have to remember this uh, to make uh, the judgment or make sure that your reach is close to the correct position. Violin is a piece of art. It's not mathematics. Okay, violin is not one plus one equals three. Okay, it's not like that. One plus one equals three. Yes, I'm correct. So, violin is a piece of art that you do bring your personality out, but you must know what you want. Okay? So we do have a standard for the violin, the standard uh, measurement for violin. We don't have standard measurement for viola, but we do have in violin. Okay? Some violin, the body is smaller, some, but some violin, the body is bigger. So we don't measure the body length, we measure the string length. Okay, the string lens. String lens. Okay, now I'll pause the violin. Of course, I need a, a longer measure. String lens from the nut, from here, from here, to the bridge, to the bridge. Okay, we measure this lens. We measure the lens from the nut to the bridge. Right now, 328 millimeter. 328 millimeters. Okay, so this measurement is important. 328 millimeters. Of course, it is not a crime, a little more or a little less. Okay, why I say standard measurements is the position. The musician used to play the position, okay, the use. If the string length is smaller than 328, then the position is small, okay? So if the musician complains, oh, this violin is, the position is too small, I always uh, play and the, 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 the sound is, intonation is too high, then you have to move the bridge back a little bit, okay? On the contrary, some lady says, oh, I have a very small hand, and the position is just too big. I want a small position. So if you have to adjust for the players, so you regard, regardless the sound, you forget the sound, you have to play, place the bridge leader in front to make the string length smaller. Violin is very, something very sensitive. A tiny difference of the length will make a huge difference of the intonation, for example. And a high position. This is one sound, okay? I don't move the position, I only move. Almost like a half note. So much difference. So if you can reach, some people can small. Every time, you say bigger. I can't. <laughs> okay. So then you have to make the position a little smaller for the musician, because he or she cannot make effort every time he's. A, he cannot do that. I have done. Okay, then you make it a little, position smaller to make it comfortable. 
It's just a, a, a one millimeter difference. One millimeter. This is one millimeter. One millimeter difference. Half a no difference. So this is very, very important to know the correct or standard. We, we, I don't want to use the, the word correct. Then correct may also be wrong. Huh? <laughs> so standard, normal, eh? we use 328. Okay. Another thing, secret. Shh, don't tell anybody. Is uh, <laughs> is. It doesn't matter how big the part is. Okay, strut one is 355, 356, 357. Small one has a 354. But from here to the F hole, in the middle of the F hole, is always 120, 195. So always from here to the F hole to cut, to the cut. See, this is this is absolutely correct. <coughs> 195. From here, from here to the F hole here. Okay. From here to the F hole, cut here, 195. Okay. See, 195. So regardless, yeah, yeah, yes, yes. From here. From here, from here, from absolute here. Oh, okay. Yeah, two, yeah, it's hard. Okay, 195. So, yeah, from here, from here, from the very top, from the very top, from here, to the F hole in the middle. Okay. No. Oh. Okay. 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 For full size, uh. full size, yes, of course, we're talking full size. Because you measure the one that go wrong. Full size. Full size. Not your size. Okay. So the body can be bigger, but can be smaller. But when the violin maker make the violin, because they, they need to make a measurement, so they always make it from here to here, the F code is 195. So that makes sure that from here to here is 328. So this is a theoretically only based on strategy values. And only based on the strategy values. Because we have a Cagliano, Guadagnini, we have Amati, we have many other models which is very different, smaller. Like I have a very two violins here. Yes, print here, please. So this violin is smaller. It's a multi model. So the, the whole violin is smaller. So you, you cannot say violin is I say it again a piece of art. So it's not it's not mathematics. You have to be like that. Like a human being you have taller and smaller. Right? So you cannot say everyone wears the same shoes. It's not it's not possible. Okay? So as far as you know, the standard is one hundred and ninety-five here and two hundred and twenty-eight up to here, then you know you have a basic idea how the violin works. Okay. Any questions? I can't for three. Any questions? Three. Okay. No question. Uh,